guys, it's Sushix here, and welcome to Pixelmon Season 3. This is Episode 1, and if you guys have been following me on Twitter or watching any of my previous videos, I, uh, I mentioned that I was going to be starting a new Pixelmon season, and uh, this season is going to be like Season 1. So it's going to be uh, just classic vanilla Pixelmon. We're going to jump straight into it, and it's going to be a lot of fun, and this is we're going back to our roots. We're going back to Pixelmon Season 1, where we just had fun playing Pixelmon and and it's uh, you know we're gonna make a house we're gonna catch all the Pokemon and it's gonna be a lots and lots of fun. So when I was thinking of what starter Pokemon I was gonna choose for this new series here, I was like, ah, I normally choose uh, Gen One. I think during our first season, I think I picked Cyndaquil, which is Gen Two. Uh, during I think uh, my Poke Peak series, I picked Torchix as Gen Three. And I don't really like Gen 5, to be honest. So we're going to go with Gen 4, and we're going to go with one of my favorite Pokemon, actually. We're going to go with Piplup, because Piplup is so cute. Uh, another thing to mention is I'm also, I also changed up my texture pack a bit since, like, like before. Like, I, I only made this, uh, or put this together before. Um, so this is a mix of the newest Pokeballers pack, which was made by Craft Battle Judy on his server. Um, but I took like some of the uh, the textures from that. I mixed it with the texture pack I already had, and now we've got this whole new thing. And you might see changes on it uh, in the future because I like threw this all together, and there might be one or two blocks that I want to change. Uh, but besides that, yeah, this is pretty much a, a a kind of new looking texture pack. We got the same dirt blocks, but I feel like it's greener. I feel like it just looks like better. I don't know. Um, but yeah, this is going to be a lot of fun, and we are just starting fresh. And I don't know. I'm just so excited to get back to vanilla Pixelmon, just classic, classic Pixelmon like we did in Season 1, because that was so fun to do, and, I mean, Season 2, as fun as that was, we were spending a lot of time, hey, hey, don't do that, ah, uh, I got them, them new world blues, I got, I got <laughs> all those, uh, new chunks rendering and everything, so, yeah, P Season 2, as fun as that was, there was just, we weren't really, I don't know, focused a lot on Pixelmon, we were more focused on, like, building and using all the different mods that we had, um, and then, you know, the server series that I had, like, Pokey Peaks and the Hoenn server that I have currently going. And the Hoenn server series isn't ending. Like, this is just, they're both running alongside each other. Um, those are, like, they're on servers, so they can be kind of difficult, um, to do. And the Hoenn one, obviously, is an adventure server, so I can't, like, build a house or anything unless it's, like, in a plot. It's not really the same thing. And then Journey, that was also really, really fun to do. Um, but... Again, like, that was that was us consistently moving and loading tons of chunks and me having to build a town every couple of episodes or at least build something new, which I just didn't have time for in the end. Um, so, yeah, we're just going to Classic Classic Pixel one. We're going to be collecting apricorns, we're going to be building a house, and it's going to be so much fun. Like, I haven't done this in so long. Since Season 1, I haven't, like, done pretty much what I plan to do for this series. Um, so, yeah, anyway, let's get started. Uh, we collected our first apricorn, which is great. We got a green apricorn, although I would pretty much prefer... Um, uh, what do you call it? The ye yellow ones and the black ones. Because we need to get them, uh, get them Ultra Balls. Nothing else really matters besides them Ultra Balls. Um, oh, you know, and Master Balls. Oh, also, uh, just updated, uh, uh before this episode, I threw out a, uh, an update video on the latest version of Pixelmon, and 3.3.5 came out, which adds Lugia, which is so awesome, and I can't wait to try and catch Lugia throughout this series. Um, one thing I want to, I want to mention is that I crashed, and I'm going to be right back. Alright, we are back. I don't know what that was. Uh, the crash that, the infamous crash that happens on like nearly every one of my videos. I think I may have even fixed it. I don't know. I, I went, I did some Googling right after it crashed and I was like, hey, did you Google? And then, I don't know, I went into like my Nvidia settings and then reset them to default because I may have messed with them a while back because I'm an idiot. And, uh, I don't know. We'll see if I ever crash again. If I don't, I've just fixed my crashing issue. If not, still don't know what the problem is. Um, but we're going to move on from that and uh, I forget it completely what I was talking about. But I'm super excited for this series to start and you, if you guys are super excited and you are ready for this series don't forget to chuck me a like uh, down below press that like button it really really helps me out especially for this first episode if we can get this series uh, like popular and we can get it like pumped up on those search results we can actually get this series going really really well and if I can see enough support and likes for oh hello hello Teddy Sora um, if, we, if I can see enough support from it from you guys in the comments and the likes, I will make this into a daily series. And it's not going to be like when I said I'm going to make Journey into a daily series and only lasted a week. Um, the only reason that that series didn't continue is after like four or five episodes and no, like nothing new was being built. I was like, I can't do the next episode without building something. Now this is completely different. Ooh, a Poke Loot! Um, so yeah, this can this can easily be a daily series like it used to be uh, with Pixelmon Season 1. Uh, so Pixelmon Season 3... If you want, like, one sentence to kind of explain what it is, uh, Pixelmon Season 3 is pretty much exactly like Pixelmon Season 1. 
uh, just as awesome and just as sexy. I froze a little bit there, I don't know what that was. Again, just more chunk loading or whatever. So I want to kind of build my house like nearby where we spawned. Although I don't want to... Oh, we do live close to a desert. Deserts are always great. Uh, if you've watched any of my pixel on... Oh my god, that's that's a really cool looking cave. Uh, we could do something with that. I don't know. Leave a comment down below what you think we could do with this cave. Like, I feel like we can build a house or just like something cool here. You know what? Let's build a house like right nearby. That's a really... Oh, wait. Where's... Didn't I chop down a tree? I must have, I must have lost that. Oh my god, another pokey loot. Bulk up. Okay, so we got two pokey loots already. That's really, really good. Uh, Mill tank, we can't take you on. We need someone to take on. Maybe we should try and find some magic up or something. I feel like we should try and find some magic up. Uh, let's grab this. Uh, <clears throat> grab this wood though. Ooh, we got an achievement. Getting wood. Hell yeah. Got some of that wood. Um, oh, we also need food. 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 Where's the best place to get food? I keep forgetting. Oh, we should try and find like a a village or something. Cause that's how I always used to get food. It's just finding a village. And then just taking everything. Um, you know what? We're going to start breaking all these. And I guess we got to get ready for a farm. Because I completely forget at the start of a Pixelmon series, it's kind of hard to get food. Alright, so we got a bunch of seeds now. Yeah, it's kind of hard to get food because, like, uh, there's no cows or anything for you to kill. So you can pretty much, like, plant food or try and get lucky enough to find a village. Um, this, is, this is the right biome to find a village, right? Uh, although, I don't know that I want to build in a plains biome. This is a forest biome here, but... Uh, oh, wait, maybe we should go into this biome over here. Yeah, this is a really cool looking biome. Alright, so we found where we're going to start off our first house. And I say first house because generally, if the series lasts long enough, I just get like bored of the house and I make a new house somewhere completely different. That happened in both Season 1 and Season 2. And we're just like, yep, that lag spike happens uh, every now and again. It only, it only happens like when we explore new places and whatever, so it, because this is the first episode, it might happen a few more times. Um, but it shouldn't really happen much throughout the series, especially if we're like staying in relatively the same place. Uh, so let's build... I don't know, I'd like to build near this river here. So, uh, frozen again, there we go. Um, let's go over here. Wait, do I have anything open? Oh, wait, I have a bunch of shit open. I should probably close all of that. Uh, close all of this. And, okay, closed Photoshop, closed Sony Vegas. Yeah, I'm doing tons of work. Uh, I might even just close my browsers as well, because I have, like, 10 million tabs open at any one time. And, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to close pretty much everything on my computer, and if I had anything important open, I'm going to deal with it afterwards. Because this recording and you guys are more important to me right now. Alright, so I closed everything. Hopefully, that makes a slight difference. We did finally find some magic up, which is going to be good to get our first few levels up. Um, because we did get a Dusk Ball, I think when it gets night time, I'm going to try and catch a new Pokemon. So we at least have, like, one new Pokemon to start this series off, but it doesn't really matter. Either way, um, for the first episode, you don't really need a new Pokemon. Um, so yeah, if you weren't aware, if you don't know what I'm doing right now, uh, Magikarp don't get an ability that, or a move, sorry, that can actually hurt you until, like, level 15. And that's when they get tackled. So before level 15, no matter what level Pokemon you have, uh, you can kill them. So, we got a raw fish. Oh, I thought I changed the texture. I don't like that texture. It's part of the Pokeballers thing. I don't like it. Um, so, yeah, you can pretty much kill any Magikarp, no matter what Pokemon you have, as long as the Magikarp is under level 15. So, <clears throat> just going to keep using Pound. This level 5... Oh, although, Magikarp give, like, next to no experience. So, after the first, like, 5, 10 levels of your Pokemon, they're going to be, like... It's, gonna, it's not going to be worth trying to kill Magikarp. But at these really, really early levels, when you're starting off, Magikarp are really, really good. Um, so I think this area right here, like, between these two rivers is actually a really nice place. Like, if you look on the map here, there's, like, just this, like, bit of land between two rivers. I like it. Alright, so we're gonna start off here. This is where we're gonna start building a house. And, uh, hello, Ledbia. How you doing? Um, now, I just want to find more Pokemon to train again, so let's just plant that down. Uh, we can't run anymore either, so I think it's about time. You know what? I'm gonna start, like, putting my stuff over here. We got, uh, we got a black apricorn, which is great for the Ultra Balls. Um, ah, let's put our niche together. And, I don't know, there's no villages anywhere. Probably should have tried to find a village before I started this episode. Although, I did want to start the episode, like, at the Pokemon selection screen. So, it was, like, right from the very beginning, you guys are there. Um, let's put all that there. Okay, so we have ourselves a crafting table. Then, uh, I want to make a hoe. But, it's always best to just make it a wooden pick. And, uh... And uh, get some stone and then just make stone tools. So what we're going to do is we're going to dig out some dirt here and get down to stone. Come on. So it looks like only some of the items that I put into the texture pack have actually worked. 
because, like, all, obviously all the blocks, I think all the blocks are the only things that changed. I don't know why the items didn't change. I'm going to have to look back at that after this next episode because uh, I also wanted the Sfax texture pack for, like, all the tools and stuff. Um, so, I don't know what's up with that. But we'll, uh, we'll move on. So I got, like, seven pieces of cobble. That's good enough to get, I don't know, we'll get, uh, we'll start off with uh, a stone pick. Then we're going to go... Okay, the good thing is about Pixelmon, we don't need a sword. So then I'm going to go into a hoe, because I want to start planting some food. Then I guess we're going to need... Oh, we're going to need an axe. But let's just get a shovel, because that's all we can do at the moment. Um, we're going to put all that stuff there. I have inventory tweaks, which is great. Love inventory tweaks. Uh, so let's just quickly uh, plant some stuff. So we can have some food by, like, next episode at least. If we don't find a village or something like that. Uh, all oh, this sand here is getting in my way. Alright, let's just get rid of all of this. And bam, 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 bam. Bam, okay. Plant all these seeds. So this wheat should be good enough for like a few pieces of bread. Which is honestly not that great. Um, but, I don't know, we'll make do. Oh, I'm super excited for this series to start. Wow, that was a lot of S words. Super excited for the series to start. Uh, alright, we want to go get more cobblestone so we can have an axe. Uh, and we are at night time, which is perfect for catching new Pokemon. Oh, also this coal right here, which is great. Sometimes it takes me like 10 years to find coal, and sometimes I can find it immediately. Uh, so this coal being here is good, because we can get some torches ready, and uh, you guys can actually see what I'm doing. Because I know sometimes some people have their uh, their brightness on their monitors really low, and they don't even realize until they watch videos, and they're like, how could he see? I can't even see what's going on. Because sometimes I've been in caves, like this one, and I get comments like, I couldn't see a bloody thing. Um, so sometimes people can see and sometimes people can't. It's just because people's monitors, settings, I think I've said people's enough times. So that's 17 pieces of coal. That's enough coal for a while. And uh, we also got seven pieces of cobblestone. Um, so let's just, let's, uh, what do we got? Okay, so we need an axe and I'm going to make a hammer because I generally like to replace the slot where I normally put a, a sword. I like to replace it with the, the hammer. Which is like that. Oh, we just don't have enough cobble. Let me just go get one more piece of cobble. Oh, come back. Come back, cobble. And... Alright, let's get that. Alright, so if you don't know what the hammer's used for, the hammer's used for smithing uh, to make uh, the different Pokeballs and stuff. It's how you make Pokeballs in the world. Now, let's grab that. Gonna put that around there. We have ourselves a stone hammer. So we have all the tools that we need. Um, now, let's just use the rest of these into... I don't know, that might be too many torches. Let's only make... Oh, nine torches, don't... No, 36. Okay, 36 torches is alright. I'm happy with that. We're going to start losing, losing health soon, because we need to eat. Um, oh, wait, I just realized we got raw fish from killing the Magikarp. Uh, alright, let's go quickly make a furnace. We already have coal. Oh, God, that Magikarp saved our lives. Okay. I completely just missed that we got that raw fish. I, like, I saw it, because I made the comment about the texture of it. And, uh, completely just didn't even realize that we could eat it. <laughs> so let's go ahead and cook that. So we're going to get our first furnace as well. Also another thing I like about playing Pixelmon is like because there's no mobs, we can start building outside and uh, it's not going to matter. Like we're not going to get slaughtered by enemies during the night. Um, I like, I actually like that texture. So kudos to the Pokeballs uh, texture pack thing because that's a nice texture for the furnace. Just like the nice orange gradient there. I like it. Um, so we have that fish cooking... We have bulk up. Bulk up's like pointless, I guess. We're gonna have to chop down some more trees so we can. Uh, oh, delicious fish achievement get. Um, so we can get some chests going and stuff. So we get doing all the basics. We're going. We're heading back to basics. But uh, I don't know. I'm super hyped for this series. Just getting back to like normal Pixelmon because season one, it was so fun and I I just ever since I ended it, I regretted ending it. Like I wish I just continued that series to like episode 100 plus because. I don't know, I had so much fun with that, and you guys really, really enjoyed it, and all the episodes were getting, like, 500 likes, and it was crazy, and, I don't know, that was just, like, that series was, like, the best time on my on my channel, and, I don't know, I'm just trying to bring it back. We're not going to be able to replicate it perfectly. Obviously, my channel has uh, lost a little bit of active subscribers since then, so we're only, I mean, hopefully we're going to be getting 100 plus likes. Um, I don't know, we're going to, I honestly don't know what's happening anymore. But um, I just want to go back to what I really enjoy, and this sort of just vanilla Pixelmon is what I enjoy, and from what I've heard, it's what you guys enjoy. So, uh, if you guys want to see more of this, I know I've said it before, but I'm going to say it again, don't forget to leave a like down below. Um, oh my god, there's something I've completely missed. There's something I completely forgot to talk to you guys about. Okay, so, uh, if you guys have watched 
what series was it? You know, I'm just going to do a little bit of work here and there while I'm talking. Um, on the Pixel League series, the one I did with, like, Terrace HD and all that fun stuff, um, I had a thing where people in the comments, I put a statue of them, and I'm, I was going to do that in the, um, in my Reach modded SMP server, like, that series, uh, but I've decided I'm going to do it in this series now, and I've added the statues mod, and so basically, if you guys want to be a statue in this, I don't know if I can do it, I kind of, I think I need iron to make it. Um, I can quickly Google it. Go on, but this is classic sushi. It's Googling stuff in the middle of an episode. Um, uh, okay, if I go to my history, because I'm going gonna, gonna to find the website easier, and then search statue, and then we go to the wiki page thing that the person has set up, and then I'm sure there is... Uh, oh, okay, we'll go to the original thread from Atomic Maiden, and, uh, and I'm trying to keep talking here, so it's not, like, completely stupid. Alright, so we're here, recipes... Yeah, it's two pieces of iron and two sticks. So, I mean, sticks are easy. It's the iron that we need. So I wonder... Oh, wait, there was the big... The, 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 talking. Uh, where was that big cave? Now that we have, like, full food and we have, like, an extra fish, and we know that we can just get fish from killing Magikarp, uh, the cave was... I think I think that's it. Like, over there. So we're going to go to that big cave. We're going to get some iron. I'm going to make my first statue, and it's going to be of myself. You know? Because we really need those, those Sushik statues going. Um, if you guys are playing your own Pixelmon world and you have statues involved, uh, you know, uh, make a statue of me and tweet it to me and I'm going to retweet it. This is a different cave, but it doesn't have any iron. Alright, yeah, if you guys tweet me a picture of, like, a statue of myself in your own Minecraft world, whether it be Pixelmon or just normal Minecraft stuffs, uh, I don't know, I might even, like, feature it in a video or something. That'd be pretty cool. I also want to, like, back when I was doing Pixelmon Season 1, I was featuring, uh, fan art and stuff, and then... I slowly stopped featuring the fan art because I just couldn't be bothered like putting in the videos and then people stopped making them. Uh, so if you guys want to make any sort of fan art, whether that be like 3D stuff, uh, I know a lot of you guys have actually subscribed to me because I made like the 3D Cinema 4D tutorial. So if you guys want to make like something on there, if you guys want to draw something, uh, do something on Photoshop, I don't know, if you make any sort of fan art for me, uh, I'll put it in the next episode. I'll, I'll choose the best person, I'll put it in the next episode. So that's something I want to go back to doing because I want to... I don't know, thank you guys, like, those people are, like, super dedicated to, like, helping me out, and those people have been here for, like, ages. You're just, like, the most awesome sort of people. So, yeah. Uh, we have torches, which is great, so I'm just gonna play some... Oh, there's some iron! Okay, so we got some iron in the first episode, uh, which is good, because sometimes I can be, like, really stupid and just never get iron. Do we only get one piece? In the whole vein, you only give me one. Wow, I needed two. Minimum of two. That's all I'm asking for, is two pieces of iron. And you're only giving me one. Oh shit, the sun's rising. Well, we're not going to be able to catch our Pokemon. That's fine, doesn't really matter. I wasn't that concerned about catching a Pokemon this episode. Uh, that's the same cave that we just went into, right? This one right here is where we went in. So there should be like caves or something here. Um, oh, let's, let's get that out of the way. Um, oh wow, that lava is really, really red. Might want to change that block as well, I don't know. Oh, here we go, here's a nice cave. Come on, give me some iron. Give me just one piece of iron. You gave me one piece before, just give me one piece. I don't even need an entire vein. There we go. Alright. Yeah. Oh, and we have some of this stuff. Uh, aluminium ore. I forget what that's for, but I think we need iron to mine it, so we're just going to get that another time. Aluminium ore is something that only Pixelmon has added. And why is you giving me so little veins of iron? This is ridiculous. Uh, I don't know. I only needed two, though, because I don't really care about making the tools at the moment. I just wanted to make the hammer so I could, uh... Oh, oh by the way, there's two different hammers. There's the Pixelmon hammer, and then there's the Statue's hammer. And they're two different hammers, so... I might have been using the word hammer and confusing some people, so... Hopefully that clears it up for you. <laughs> um, so where did we live? I probably should have set a waypoint. I don't think it's going to be too difficult to find. We just headed in this direction, yep. There was a lot of Pokemon around us. I should do a little bit more training before we end this here episode. Um, we're nearly at 20 minutes. Eh, would you? Oh, nope. Okay. Uh, let's eat our last fish. Lady Bear. Lady Bear. I like <laughs> I like mimicking. Uh, mimicking. Uh, mimicking the Pokemon because they they got like cool sounds. Uh, Minon. Minon level nine. We could take you on, right? Uh, but I say, yeah, Minon. Oh, okay, sorry, I thought it said... Wait, what was that? Plus or is it... Okay, yeah, sorry. When my Pokemon said Plip, you know what? I'm not even going to say it because it's just... It's, it's stupid. It sounds really stupid what I'm about to say. Uh, why are you not doing any damage? Are you... You are... 
Uh, you're paralyzed. Okay, let's run away because I don't have a healing place and we haven't found a Pokemon Center. And oh my god, we need to find a Pokemon Center. Uh, yep, so we can only. <laughs> I don't know what that sound was. We have one health on our Piplop. Jeez, alright. Uh, so we can only face Magikarp now. Um, there's another Apricorn over there. I'm not even used to, like, collecting Apricorns again. Because I didn't collect it through all of Pixelmon Journey, and it's been a long time since I had to collect Apricorns in, like, Pixelmon Season 2. So, oof. Um, getting back to the old stuff. Uh, alright, let's go, let's just search, oh my god, it's an Eevee! I can't catch it, because it's not night time, so it's just going to be a waste of the ball, the Dusk Ball. But, uh, this biome spawns Eevee, so I'm sure we're going to find more. But, uh, that's, that's kind of weird to see an Eevee, like, straight off the bat in the first episode. They're generally kind of rare. Uh, I thought that was a cave, damn. Uh, Magikarp, 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 Magikarp. I think if you say Magikarp, like, a million times, they actually spawn. So, that didn't work for me. Okay, <laughs> we, uh, we live somewhere over here. Mm, it was it was the river on this side, right? But yeah, we definitely started making stuff on the river, and uh, and uh, I can see. Yes, here we are. There we go. Oh, I thought I broke it. Okay. Um, what am I doing? Oh, right. We're gonna smelt the iron. I'm gonna make a statue of myself, and then we're gonna end the episode. I'm gonna quickly go look for some more magic up. Why is there no magic up here? What are you doing? I'm out of food again, Magikarp. I need to kill more of you. Also, I'd like to level up my Piplop if, uh, if I can. Um, also, it'd be nice to try and, you know, find a Pokemon Center. They're generally not too difficult to find. I'm sure if we don't find one by the end of this episode, then we'll find one next episode. They do spawn in uh, this biome. I keep forgetting what it's called. It's called the Roofed Forest Biome. So, the, yeah, they do spawn in this Roofed Forest Biome. Here's a bunch of Magikarp. There's a level 12 one. Might take a little bit for us to kill it, but uh, we'll get it. And it should get us up to at least level 8. Which is, which is great. Ah, I rhymed. Um, so yeah, so we're going to kill Magikarp, and then we're going to quickly just like run down to the end of this river, looking for a Pokemon Center, and if we don't find one, I'm just going to run back to my furnace, and we're going to make the statue, and I'm going to end the episode. I've got to set out like a proper area to put all the statues there. I need like a, a graveyard or something. It's probably not something so like dark. Oh, we, wow, we went up to level 9. Jeez, thanks Magikarp. Uh, so we're gonna go just down here quickly, see if we can spot a, a Pokemon Center. Pokemon Centers are really easy to spot if they come up, and no. No Pokemon Center for us. Uh, okay. Well, let's head back. Uh, we got... Oh, I wanna get level 10. You know what, I wanna get level 10 before we end this. So, there's a level 6 Magikarp. A 16 one is going to kill us. A 17 one over there. Oh, a 6 one is gonna give us, like, nothing. Here, there's a bunch of magic up here. Ooh, a 12. Yes. All right. Oh, we have bubble now. Although, I don't know if, if that's going to do more damage than tackle, because it's going to be ineffective. Yeah. Let's just go back to pound. Uh, but we have a water move, which is great. So if we can find a Pokemon Center by next episode, then we can, like, head to the desert and start training on, like, uh, Geodudes and stuff like that, because that'll be great. And Numels. Numels and Geodudes. Yeah, level 10. Awesome. Okay, we got level 10. That's the training for today. Oh, I'm going to grab this sugar cane. Yeah, boy, we need that sugar cane. Uh, give it, okay. And now we just gotta head back home. We gotta slowly waddle back home because we don't have any food. We do have food, just nothing that we can eat at the moment. Well, we can eat it, but it's gonna be useless. I like to cook my food, always like to cook my food before we eat it. Because it just seems like a waste if I eat the raw fish. Unless, like, I'm gonna die. But I generally don't play in a game mode that allows me to die, which is like, I don't know, the super hard mode. Minecraft or whatever. Um, so let's put this in there. Oh, I still need to change this. Yeah, for, so the Pokeballers have iron ingots as the magnets. So I need to change that. As I said, all items are like screwed up. <clears throat> so let's go like this. And we're going to go like this. And we got ourselves a hammer. All right, next we just grab cobblestone. You can actually use it with any block, I believe. And I'm going to place it. Where are we going to start this? Let's start it up here. So let's, let's just clear it out a little bit. Get rid of all of the U blocks. And... Alright, <clears throat> got rid of all of them. We also got some seeds, which is nice. And I'm going to start it. First statue is of me. So we're going to go Super Sushix. And there we go. Um, and uh, Sculpt. And to make it, I'm going to I'm gonna color it in later. But to color it in, you need like the different, you need like dyes and stuff. You need uh, lapis and whatever. So we'll, we'll be coloring in the statues when I can get those sort of materials. But for now, there's that. Oh. Um, uh, okay, wait. Okay, wait, wait, wait. 
All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna make a sign real quick. Oh wait, we already had a bunch of wood. Oh, we have dark wood. Yes. All right, dark wood's kind of cool. Uh, so let's go like that, and we have this one piece of thingy here. We got three signs, and then. Alright, oh, stop. No, give me that. Give me that. Ah, thank you. <clears throat> so what we're going to do is we're going to put a sign at the front of the person, and it's going to say, uh, we're going to go like this. Super Sushix is sexy. I'm going to do the capital X for the more sexiness. So if you want to be a uh, Minecraft person in my world, uh, leave a, uh, yeah, leave a comment down below with your Minecraft username, and I'll choose one lucky person to just be a statue, and then I'll also put... X person is sexy. You get to be sexy in this world. That's the new thing. That's what all the signs are going to say. Uh, so yeah, leave your Minecraft name down below. And uh, also, if you'd like to leave a nickname for Piplop, because uh, I'm also getting back into renaming my Pokemon as to what you guys comment. So that'll be awesome. Uh, did I put... I did put the fish in here. Let's eat this while I end the episode. So... Yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to leave a like down below if you enjoyed this episode and you want to see this series continue, even though it pretty much will continue. Uh, but if you want to see this series flourish and be super awesome, uh, definitely leave a like down below. Every like super helps me out, and I love all of you guys. And uh, leave a comment down below with your Minecraft username so you can add a statue and be sexy, like me. And uh, what was the other? Oh, yeah, and leave a comment down below of your nickname for Piplop so I can rename him. Uh, next episode and give you a little shout out and also don't forget to subscribe for more of this series I'm gonna go into this view and uh, so yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Pixmon season 3 Goodbye